Hey there everyone, it's Andy from Nailer Body Design back again with a quick tutorial on how to trap bar deadlift. The trap bar is a great alternative to standard deadlifting and is awesome for those with back issues like myself. Firstly notice I go through the same little setup routine before each lift. If you create your own setup routine it will really help you focus your mind and your body for what is probably going to be the heaviest type of lift that you do. No point just grabbing the bar and pulling and hoping for the best. So the first major part before I start is I take a good deep breath of air this creates a nice strong pressure in my core and this is protecting my back. It will stabilise the whole lift. On the way up, I'll be exhaling. If you're holding on to your breath on the way up, chances are it's going to go a bit dark and you're going to get tweety birds around your head. Bad times. I start with my ass below my shoulders. This is absolutely vital to keep my back nice and straight and protected as I begin to move up. I take the slack out of the bar so there's no jerking of the bar. It's all nice and smooth. I use my legs to really drive the floor down to commence the lift. In my mind, I'm using the cue of pushing the floor down and not of standing up. This really works for me and keeps my lift in good form. As, I'll, as I ascend, you'll notice my back stays straight. If your back is rounding, uh, drop the weight and, and follow this form until you get stronger and then begin to progress back again. As the bar leaves the floor, you can then begin to accelerate up through the lift and bring in your glutes and your low back into the movement. At the top, be sure not to hyper extend and lean backwards. This type of bar will really rock backwards if you do not control it. This is really not good for your posture and your back health. At the top, I then take in a deep breath of air and under control, descend back down to the start. I would like to say, be sure to use the negatives of this. I see a lot of people just dropping the bar down. I don't think that's particularly helpful. If you have any questions on how to trap bar deadlift, leave me a comment. I'll be happy to answer. And don't forget to give the video a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel for more just like this. Thanks for watching. Oh,